we'll check in on some uh, Michigan weather coming up here and see <laughs> Maybe you deal with the bad drivers. There you are have to better. drive well when you're in Michigan and have to deal with the snow, right? Yeah, and look at the distractions we have to deal with. This is Morro Bay. Look at this. How beautiful is that? KSBY.com, great place to check out the skies and, of course, the surf conditions as well, powered by Surfline. San Luis Obispo, camera shaking around a little bit. 63, Santa Maria 61, San Luis 58, Paso, Lompoc 69, and 66 in Santa Barbara. So a lot of those temperatures are above average, and we're off the uh, peak temperatures a little bit. Winds have been gusty at times, and those offshore gusty conditions will continue again tonight into tomorrow morning and into the weekend as well. It's going to drive a big warm up there. You can see AGs on the way to 76 degrees on Saturday. Seven day ticker at the bottom of your screen, a 10 day forecast available at my weather app 73 Pismo Beach 66 Hearst Castle 72 at Santa Barbara for the high today 65 in Paso 73 73 in Morro Bay today and again I think we warm from there 70 Goleta with 74 Port San Luis San Luis Obispo 71 72 Santa Maria and 63 in Cuyama here's the hourly in Paso Robles tomorrow temperatures near 70 even in the interior valleys even though the morning start will be near freezing because the skies are relatively clear. Santa Maria, mid 70s tomorrow. The wind situation in the morning offshore, locally gusty at the Cuesta grade up to 25 miles per hour, but generally the push about 5 to 15 before returning weekly in the afternoon. You can see how the offshore push kind of keeps at bay all these clouds out there in the Pacific. Big ridge of high pressure for us, and it basically doesn't change at all. We're looking at temperatures warming with cool nights and warm days. Interestingly, check out the forecast here in the upper Midwest. In Fargo, North Dakota on Friday, it's going to be 15 below at 10 o'clock in the morning with a wind chill of 30. And it actually gets worse on Saturday. And it gets worse as you get into next week. The warm day looks to be Sunday. We could even see some above zero daytime highs. But this is the middle of next week. The wind chill at 4 a.m. Wednesday, 60 below in Fargo, 51 below in Minneapolis. And it continues into Thursday as well. Finally warming up a little bit into single digits. We've got air coming basically straight off the North Pole, plunging into the upper Midwest. Why are we talking about it? Because take a look at these numbers. Mid 70s for highs in Santa Maria, San Luis, close in 70 in Santa Barbara tomorrow. Mid 70s for Santa Inez Valley folks and 74 in AG, 75 Nipomo, 68 Shandon, 72 Morro Bay, 67 Atascadero after a cool start in the 30s. And those nice warm temperatures continue through the weekend, cooling maybe a few degrees into early next week. Everything here is above average and a return to potential rain as we get into early February. Scott Carino, back to you.